Misleading label claims are everywhere. They bombard you while walking down the grocery store aisles. It's time to pull back the shroud to expose the industrial reality that lies behind. So what deceptive label claims do we need to be aware of? Let's look at a few of the main ones. Some grass-fed beef is actually fed a corn and soy-based diet for the last three to five months of its life in a feedlot. And the regulations don't say how much grass they need to eat before I sell this as grass-fed beef. I'm not making this up. This is the logic that gets cheap grass-fed beef into supermarkets. If you want truly grass-fed beef, you must ask for 100% grass-fed and grass-finished. <laughs> 